but let's see. Can I get over here? Ooh, I think I can. There is a pathway here. And some pigeons. Cute. I don't think this is the mill she meant. This is the house, campfire, reverend's cave beneath the city wall. That seems like a, an interesting location. There's the inn and the crypt. Can you even get anywhere from here? Exactly, were you doing here, traveler? I'm exhausted. I should leave. Nothing to say. First time I saw the model, thought I was a satyr. Uh, yeah, I do have plenty of similarities uh, with satyrs. Most of it is by choice. Uh, unless she are shapeshifters, we can look however we please. <laughs> and many folklore describe uh, unless she is having horns and hooves. The horns are uh, don't really have a style to them; uh, just horns and descriptions. I decided to set the one satyr horns because I like satyrs. They're a really, really fun monster. Really fun creature. Also often described with uh, hooves. Sometimes they should have hooves, other times they don't. It's really... It really depends on the time, on the region. Okay, these are thugs. I don't need, I don't need to be here. Uh, yeah, sometimes the descriptions vary. Uh, one of the main things that always uh, described with uh, the, the Leshi is just having uh, hair and beard made from uh, leaves. Which I do have. <laughs> I have my leafy hair and my leafy beard. Hello, Heron. G -g Greetings to the honorable gentleman. You are? Haran Brog, merchant and middleman, at your service. What brings you here, w Witcher? What do you have to offer? The re reverend sent you, I presume? They can also have moose horns. Uh, yeah, uh, most, can, most can. Again, shapeshifters. That, that's the benefit, right? <laughs> you can just be anything and everything you want. Although I guess it probably also depends a lot on the local folklore. Uh, I don't know if moose specifically live where Leshy are, have stories about. Because the Leshy, I think as far north as Poland, uh, parts of uh, Russia. I guess that's as far north as Leshy stories are, are told. I'm not sure if moose live there. I have never been that far north. I also have bushes. Yeah, I te technically it's a cape. Yeah, hold on, can I... Can I show this? Oh, I also don't have, you know... <laughs> I don't have a bottom half. I do have a little cape. Kind of uh, attached to my arm. You know, just something to show my connection to nature. <laughs> I do, I do really like my uh, my cape. Yeah, the the wooden arm, the wooden arm looks looks great. I I love I love how it came out. 
I, I really love the detail that my, my artist put into the wood. Apparently, it was very annoying to do. So I really appreciate her efforts. <laughs> I really appreciate the, the work she did for, on this. <laughs> I imagine it, it couldn't have been easy. There are my moose in Poland. Yep, probably. I'm not entirely familiar with the animals in Poland. I just know there aren't any in Bulgaria. At least as far as I know. Maybe we do have some somewhere. Although we're not exactly moose territory. Of course. W why don't I b believe you? Well, you're gonna believe me now. The eternal f, -f fire a gift from the Reverend, I presume. Either that or he stole it. <laughs> the Reverend sent me. He thinks you need a witcher. I do. The d -d dead emerge from the river at the night. A ghastly cold blows from the water, making my flesh crawl. Help me. I'll s spare no exp expense. All right, we got some drummers to deal with. Uh, get extra parts, and we'll get some more orange. in exchange for Always lovely. About Salamandra, and throw in one hundred orange for my expenses. I heard you were looking for Salamandra, but if so, you're looking for trouble. It's no m matter to me. You you have a deal. These d damned undead are my concern. They scare customers off and d d destroy my crates. And this is a valuable shipment for a special client. Where are these? Where would I find drowners? these drowners? W where? At the river's edge. They creep out of the water after dusk. I see. Witcher! I did to find some drowners earlier. So we just have deer. Yeah, I didn't think we have any moose. <laughs> We're not exactly a moose country, are we? Our mutual friend Zoltan Our sent mutual me. friend Zoltan Let's gamble, sent me. my guy. So he's g got you hooked too. Clever little r runt. <laughs> You've no idea what you're getting into. B worse than fist tech. Relax. <laughs> I only play when I want to. Uh, that's how that's it starts. They all only say. when you want to. So, shall we? <laughs> <laughs> all right. Let's continue the gambling. Hell yeah. <laughs> Oh, he wants five to start. He's a big spender. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna... It makes a jingle noise when you hover over the money. Wow. <laughs> it sounds... Tell me this doesn't sound like a slot machine. Tell me this isn't a slot machine noise. <laughs> Don't go broke. I will try, Kudrovsky. <laughs> hello, hello, welcome to the stream. This is the part where I lose all my money. You're just in time. <laughs> there are moose in Finland, Poland, and Russia. Yeah, that sounds about right. That's about as that that's pretty northish. That sounds good for moose territory. <laughs> yeah, cause the thing is cause I can see moose being in Poland. But not in a country like uh, Netherlands or something, which is on the same level as Poland. Well, uh, I guess Poland is more to the east. It gets a bit colder there usually. All right, five gold. Let's go. Well, I need to lower my model a little bit. It's still hiding the chat. I do need to fix. Uh, Fix some things in OBS. What did I get? Ooh, two pairs. What did you get? Ooh, you also have two pairs. 
Ah. I'm gonna hope this one turns into something good. Alright. Hopefully this should be enough. I don't think it's gonna be... Oh, I won. Good. Oh, there we go. No moose in, the, in the Netherlands. Yeah, in, I think moose prefer like more foresty areas. I don't know how foresty Netherlands is. It, it, it's more like just even plains in the Netherlands. Alright, reroll these three. Let's go. Daddy needs a new pair of shoes. Let's go. Nope. Damn. Might lose this one. Definitely gonna lose this one. Alright, tiebreaker round. Wow, nothing. Yeah, I've got nothing. I'm gonna reroll all of them. <laughs> I hope for the best. Right, well, I have, yeah, I have a, a few things. Two pairs. Okay, well, you know what? Fuck you, Heron. God. Uh, needs money for Rakia. <laughs> The eternal f, f fire a gift from the reverend, I presume. Play me again, Heron. This isn't over yet. <laughs> I gotta buy all the Rakia. Two pairs. Decent. And you got one pair. No, I am I am not raising any money. I am not. No. I'm not confident enough in this. <laughs> Alright, well I still have two pairs. Hopefully he won't get anything more. He didn't. Okay, good. Alright, we're we're doing good. We're doing we're winning. We're winning so far. Let's go. Two fours. Mm. We both have a pair. All the English in the streams. Uh, yeah, so far I just the stream in English. I haven't really done any Bulgarian streams. I do have an idea that where, you know, I will for a stream that I will talk Bulgarian in, but I will require more people for that. <laughs> But yeah, so far my streams are just in English. I haven't, I don't stream in Bulgarian. So, for now at least. Maybe I will. Alright, alright. Give me something better. Come on. Give me something better. Ooh, nice. Four fours. And that's how you do it. Booyah. And I have the same exact amount of money as I did when I started. I have gained nothing. I have not, nothing has changed. <laughs> I mean, I, I did get... Ooh, non-humans. Uh, I did get the progress for a quest, so I guess that changed. What's this? A pamphlet describing the great conspiracy of the non-humans and their schemes over the centuries. Contains many lies, but simultaneously provides some useful information of the elder races. There we go. It's anonymous. Of course it's anonymous. Because if you put your name on something like this, you become a target for the squirrels. 
It was then that the elven wise men called the sages gathered in the dungeons beneath Reinhold Castle. The eldest of them said, The day and the hours have come. We are here to discuss the fall of humans. We will avenge the death of Lara Doran. We will shed their blood and drown the world in chaos. We will hide in the forests for 500 years while the Chosen live in human cities and become their neighbors. Everyone knows their place in the plan, whether elf, dwarf, gnome, sorcerer, or Nilfgaardian. Was Nilfgaard even around, like, back then? <laughs> we will call ourselves superiors, because we have no lords over us, and we spit on gods. Wow. Then all swore an oath, oath, and each drank the blood of an innocent child. Okay. From a golden chalice. To seal the obedience to the plan. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna discard this book. Yeah, some people would understand. <laughs> okay, what did you want me to do? What quest did you give me? Ah, there it is. Yeah, because uh, uh, there is one piece of advice that uh, one of my teachers gave me that if we ever apply for a job in a foreign company uh, under known languages we should just also include Serbian and Macedonian okay. <laughs> because like even if it's a little bit we can understand it we can, <laughs> we can still get you know get along just fine <laughs> Yeah, I don't really feel like I have much of an accent. I don't even think it's British. Because, like, I pronounce my R's. Which, you know, isn't very British. I feel like mine's more neutral. I'm not sure if it's, like, American or something, but... I don't know if it's British. Like, what am I supposed to do here? Oh, at night. Okay, I need to wait at night. Sure. Man, I've I've done all of this. I I don't even remember what I need to do at this point. One of the quests sent me to Abigail. Maybe I can just go do that and then return at night. All right, let's take a walk. Oh, definitely not Australian either. <laughs> That's even more of a noticeable accent. <laughs> I definitely just lean more towards neutral American, probably. Just no idea where in America. They do still have their own accents, I just don't recognize which one's from where. that I need. Ah, visit the witch. There we go. Even though I already did visit the witch earlier. Although I guess I didn't really know why I was there. I just stopped by for a visit. Will I play Marco Beyond Brave? Oh, I definitely will play Marco. I am excited to play a Bulgarian game. That, that's pretty much the theme of, of my channel. 
that's why I also chose to be a Leshy, a Slavic spirit. All of the games I play are in some way connected to Slavic folklore. Uh, one game I played is set in like medieval Czech Czechoslovakia or Czechia, one or the other. I'm playing Yaga, which just bathe in Slavic folklore. Now with The Witcher, which yeah, is a V Slavic game. I have a, a lot of games lined up that are about Slavic culture or folklore. That's what that's what I want my channel what I want my channel to be about. One second, I have a very needy cat here that demands attention. <laughs> What? Uh, the golden apple. Yeah, I am waiting for the golden apple. I know the first episode, like, aired on the on Benete, on our main Bulgarian TV channel. But it's, like, only... Uh, the first episode is available only on YouTube in Bulgarian and super low quality. Unfortunately, it doesn't have, like, a better version. Because I, I really want to watch that. I want other people to watch it. I will advertise the hell out of that series. If it ever comes out. Because like, it's honestly been a while. I'm really starting to have my doubts. I do hope they finish it. I do hope it actually becomes a thing. Yeah, there is still time. Oh, yep. Yeah. it. The first episode is really good, though. I am excited for all, all of the characters. These are really the kind of things I want to see more of. If they're Bulgarian or Polish or Czech or Serbian, whatever. I want to see more things like this. More projects like the Golden Apple. And they're still working on it. That's good. Because I did check, I haven't really seen any updates recently on Facebook or anywhere. So I wasn't really sure what uh, the situation is. But they're still working on it, that's good. Alright, let's talk to Abigail. Hello, Abby. What do you want? People think you're the reason for the beast. I need tax. to know where the beast came from. Why ask me? Aren't witches wise in the ways of magic? Yes, but this beast is beyond me. Although I know someone else. Who would that be? The boy Alvin. He's a strong source and a diviner. What he knows we could not hope to imagine. However, if I were to give him a certain potion... Won't it hurt him? No need to fret, he'll be fine. Pump the kid Bring full me the of chemicals. Of five okay. White Myrtle, and your questions will be answered. Myrtle grows outside the village. If you lack knowledge of herbs, I have this book. It's yours for a price. To gather herbs, let's click on the selected plant. You must have the herbalism skill in the intelligence group to gather herbs. You also need to have knowledge of a given plant, which you can find in books. Herbs can be purchased from herbalists. What do you want? Do I have the herbalism skill? I believe this is, yeah, field plants for 200 go. Okay. Can't you, like, give me a, at least a discount because I'm doing you a favor over here? I still don't have the. Oh, damn. What can I sell? Uh, not the brains, I need the brains. I had completely forgotten I set stream elements to give that message. <laughs> Alright, this... Uh, oh, this is 15. Yeah, I could probably part with this. Yeah, I'm gonna... I need... I need the goat, right? 
She won't even give me a discount. Cheapskate. This is the book on animals for a hundred. This one is on bar guests for fifty. Do I not have all information on bar guests? And this is a red ribbon. To repel drowners. Ooh, for four... Four hundred lady. Okay, you know what? Yeah, I'm gonna sell a few of these. I just need... Seven gold. Yeah, I'll sell seven teeth. And get the book. There we go. Cheat. You rip-off artist. The book describes white myrtle, hellebore, celandine, ballast, crow's eyes, barber cane. I read that as barbecue. <laughs> well, why would a plant be called barbecue? Barber cane. That makes a, a little bit more sense. And see once. It also provides information on the methods of obtaining alchemical ingredients from these plants. This book adds an ingredients entry to journals. What do you want? All right, now I'm gonna meditate in your home. I hope you don't mind. I am not asking for permission. <laughs> The barbecue plant. <laughs> oh yeah, there's the herbalism. Yeah, so I, I need to spend these points just to have the, the ability to gather, apparently. What else can I do? Yeah, increase my damage. I need to increase damage. I need to be a strong boy. Vitality regeneration. One per second. How is that? How much is one? Like, what's my maximum? Because if I have like a thousand health, then one isn't going to be that useful, if we're being completely honest. May as well at least unlock the basics, right? Care what gains the ability to deflect arrows. So that's going to be useful. The Legend of the, the First Cookier was six years ago. Two years ago, the first episode came out. I think after one year, we'll have the full series. And then hopefully... I I do have the book of the first cooker. It it's it's a real it's a really fun book. I did also buy a poster with it, but I don't know where the poster is actually. I never hung up my poster. <laughs> I do kind of I do kind of regret it now because I did spend money on it. I just never did anything with it. it. It kind of it was kind of left to rot. Alright, I still have six more things to do. I can strengthen my art as well. Angle 180 degrees. Now it's just 90. Ard is a powerful sign. And then what does this do then? Uh, will any, do any of these do anything? Uh, yeah, slightly more damage. That's good. More damage is always decent. So strong and steel style are... Strong and fast are separate things. I feel like a... I feel like a gala, right? Just to give myself a bit more of an edge. And I have three points left. 
which I think I'm gonna save. I unlocked the basic things on each of the trees. I feel like that's enough for now. If I find myself lacking, I can always upgrade again. Alright, let's get some plants. Let's get these herbs. Yeah, there they are. And I'm gonna save. <laughs> uh, the game has crashed on me several times. During my first playthrough, it crashed like twice. And it crashed earlier in this uh, stream. <laughs> Another series, Miwa and Marco. I haven't actually heard of that. Oh, I'll, I'll need to check it out. I probably after 10 years, there'll be more. We'll work in studio as May, too. Oh, uh, I hope you do. Uh, would that be uh, as an animator or as a writer? Or potentially both. Wait, hold on. What, what did you need? Five white Murdo. Right. White Murdo. <laughs> As both for sure. <laughs> oh, I hope it happens. <laughs> So this Miwa and Marco is also by Studios May? That's interesting. I hadn't... I hadn't seen that. I have looked through their YouTube channel, but not... Uh, the, but I didn't see any anything else besides uh, the golden apple. All right, five white birdo. Let's go back. They have two accounts. No, oh, that I didn't know. I've just only seen the one. What do you want? Here's the white myrtle. I gathered the myrtle petals. Excellent. Now to prepare the potion. How is it made? Interested in witch's secrets, are you? Oh, I am a witcher. The recipe is yours so. if you swear to take it to your grave. I swear. Draw close and listen. Blend two ounces of cadaverin with the myrtle petals. Speak your name backwards, turn about three times leftwards, spit into the fire and stir the potion again. That Come feels like a prank. That... <laughs> I knew witch's magic would be beyond the mind. That doesn't of sound man. like a real recipe. <laughs> Grant me a moment to finish the potion. <laughs> See you later. I should return in a while. Oh, okay, what can I do in a while? What else even is there to do? There's the Drowner contract. I'm still missing one Drowner, I believe. Buried Memories. We can try... Going after the ghouls, they are right here. But also, I do have some spoilers, as I've previously played this. They did kick my butt. Let's hope it doesn't happen. Potions in the games are always strange. I mean, most of them tend to be kind of straightforward. It's mostly in folklore, where you see many different rituals that you need to perform. 
I don't think that uh, can be a mechanic, what she just described. <laughs> Mostly in games, you just uh, click on the two things and you're done. But folklore has so many things you need to set up before you actually do the things you have to do. This, this is the correct path. Oh my god, there's so many things to come. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna be here all day. I'm just gonna spend the entire stream collecting every single thing I find. Oh, no. The path to the crypt. <laughs> Collect some murder as well. I once again have five white myrtles, so I can make whatever potion she just described. Witcher games are always long. Yeah, they really are. <laughs> Man, from what I know, the, the first one is uh, probably the shortest. I gotta go see ya. I, I, have, have a good evening, man. Thank you for stopping by and chatting. I will continue collecting everything. Oh, no. Give me this one. Give me this one. Yes, thank you. What's your medallion? Set the medallion to detect nearby monsters or magic. If set to detect magic, the medallion will vibrate near places of power. To set the medallion, meditate and open the inventory. Let's look. Wait, what? Where, where do you... Select the medallion. System, hero, journal. Do I click on the actual medallion itself? Doesn't seem like it. Uh, no, this is armor, nothing that I can see. Am I just blind? Place of power. Gotta be. Alright, well, that, that did something, I would assume. I hope it's a good something. I'm also gonna save again. <laughs> No idea what it did. Uh, sign intensity increased by 100. Ooh, ooh, that's nice. All right, I'm going in to deal with some ghouls. Hopefully, <laughs> this will go well. Seems the contents of that bottle oh. caused the woman's death. The ghouls came for her remains. Wait, this is. Is this, is this Vesna? I mean, it uses the same model as Vesna, right? to the dark area. This is great. A place where I can't see a single thing. Oh, I did see this one though. Unfortunately, cannot one hit kill them after stunning. Come 
on, Gary. Come on. Fight the thing. Alright, let's see. Do I have anything in my inventory? Oh, this is the swallow potion. I really probably should have made some actual potions to prepare for this. You know, like an actual witcher. Alright, I've already read these books. I'm just gonna... I don't know. Maybe I can sell them somewhere else. Alright, I'm gonna see if I can make a... See in the, see in the dark potion. Whatever the name was supposed to be. Potions. Cat potion. That was the one. Do I have all the parts? I think I do, yeah. Uh, tawny owl. What does the tawny owl do? Increases endurance regeneration. What the hell is white go? Oh, this, this, oh, this is just a base. I'm not, not going to use this one because this one uses Drowner Brains. I still need those for the quest. I think I'll make an... Oh, am I, am I missing this one? No, I... I think I have it. Alright, good. So, if I did things right, I should have... Yeah, I can see in darkness now. I still have, like, a, uh, two unknown potions. Oh, three unknown potions. Oh, Tune Medallion. This is where you do it. To detect monsters or detect magic. I'm gonna put it to detect magic. I don't, re I don't really know what it does if... I guess if there's a shapeshifter, the medallion will react if I'm close to them. But the magic, is that just for places of power? Or are there other things it can detect? Besides the place of power I just saw. Because those look fairly noticeable. And I'm gonna keep it the monsters. Let's just meditate to get the potions ready. And go back inside. Let's go. Alon Z, baby. <laughs> now let's take the potion. Alright, nice. I like it. Where exactly did you appear? So Garrett's idea to fight these guys is to jump in front of them. Just swing down. I guess it's working, right? It's a solid strategy, from all I can see. And another place of power. I guess it's the same ritual. Yeah, no body parts though. But yeah, I was definitely supposed to be finding a blood of ghouls, but I am not.
taking a little bit of damage, but they should be good. So it seems like using the uh, the R sign for some reason temporarily negates the cat potion. <laughs> My vision gets a bit darker after I use it. And we have a stone of elements. Signs, Igni. You have learned the Igni sign, which can be used to cause damage to opponents and to light fires. Choose a sign on the left of the screen. Right click on the target to cast the sign. And these guys offer nothing. Yeah, I think I've screwed myself over a little bit. Maybe I can find ghouls elsewhere, but I don't know where else to complete this specific quest. Yeah, I can't break this down. And the dungeon doesn't have a map. Oh, I guess I'm going. I did, I did complete the quest. So. Still wondering, is this Vesna or is it just uses the same model? I guess if it was her, it would say Vesna's corpse, not girl. At least I would assume. I guess maybe someone can, can tell us. I think it can confirm with Miku. Yep. Go to the gates, which are directly in front of us. Just down this path. And of course, collect everything I see along the way. Well, not, not everything, but at some point you get annoyed ignoring things. So you start obsessively collecting. Ah, there's the barbecue plant. All right, let's get some barbecue fruit. Contains ether and albedo. All oh, right, this part came with a fight. Definitely gonna need to save here. This is a part that crashed previously, and I had to restart a lot of things. I am missing health though, so. Nah, I'm not gonna upgrade anything. Just go as is. No, no. Come on. I do actually need to spend at least an hour. Regain my health. Because this is going to be a fight. Salamandra lacking. I won't surrender my workshop for all the treasure in the world. Oh, you'll give it up, Gramps, or else. Or what? A witcher! Kill him! Not likely. Oh, just immediately going into a fight. You're ours, Witcher. You should have left Salamandra alone. This bridge will be your grave. <laughs> Alright, getting some help from the guards, thankfully. Why is the- oh my god, it deactivates my sign as well. Oh. 
this does feel slightly counterintuitive. Just for some reason, I can't attack enemies after they're stunned. Which is like the reason you would knock enemies to the ground, right? The more easily defeat them. There we Thank go. Thank you, Witcher. You saved me and my laboratory, my beakers, my treasures. Anytime. I know all too well what they're after. To use the stolen secrets, Salamandra needs equipment. Without it, the Witcher's mutagens are useless. They almost oh, grabbed they Kalkstein the... and his treasures. Oh, the they almost succeeded at Kaer Morin. Almost makes a huge difference. If I had stayed and fought the Frightener with Vesemir, I might have faced a different threat today. They were here for me. I made a choice some time back. Had you known this would happen, would you have chosen differently? Okay, we are apparently in an ad break right now. Let me see, when is the ad break gonna end? Or is it already ended? I oh, know, it tells me it's ended. All right, well, we're continuing as normal. No, it was the right decision, and I'll deal with the consequences. I'm not surprised at your answer. You don't seem like one to look back. Visit my shop in Vizima yeah, for any ingredients you need yeah. for your potions. If you've made a, a choice, you deal with the consequences, Farewell. not regret your choice. Might Rubedo be better? Shouldn't have defended the old man. You come talking again. <laughs> what are you going on about? The old man comes here and talks and talks. Gives me a headache. And I'll so he deserves death? Time. I wouldn't because if I were he talks you. A lot? He's a powerful alchemist. Hey. Uh, Captain said, only admit those with passes. I know, I know. They're moving me to Millgate tomorrow. That's where I'll stand. If you have a pass, look for me there. Hey, what? What do these guys have? An amulet. A salamander brooch. Adorned with a fiery lizard. Symbol of the secret organization behind the attack on Kaer Morin. I'm mostly interested in the, in the orins. Apparently you need a lot of damn orins to survive in this world. Do you have anything else to say? Scandalous! This is the third time they've refused to acknowledge the validity of my well, they, they don't seem to be the brightest. What brings you here? Well, apparently we've talked Farewell. about everything we gotta talk about. I dealt with your ghoul problem. Uh, God, you're a dumbass. I got rid of the ghouls in the crypt. A hundred thanks, master. Here be a month's pay. Oh, the boys will be happy. They plan to search for treasure in the crypt. Take a pick to one of the walls. I found a young woman's body inside. The ghouls came for her. Young woman? No. Oh, it's Ilsa. It can't Not be. Bad. My Ilsa. I, I, I loved her. I wouldn't know her name. It appears she poisoned herself. No, no, no! It was that vile witch! The devil's whore poisoned my Ilsa! No! I'm sorry for your loss, but I need to know about Salamandra. They have passes, they do. The only ones, leave me be. 
You have the evil eye. You bring bad tidings. Be gone! Don't mm. forget to tell the Reverend I got rid of those ghouls. Farewell. What do you mean I bring dark tidings? I have nothing to do with her dying. I'm sleeping. I just told you what happened. Please. Not enough play for this. What even is the time in this game? Can you tell what time it is? Because I am keen on that meeting at the mill. Let's <laughs> see. Is that actually something that happens? Because I do know this game is... Yeah. Either famous or infamous. Pick one. For how many women Garrett sleeps with. No drowners yet. So apparently we are not evening. I'm not sure I like how many thugs you're surrounded by, Heron. Well, I guess I'm not your mother. It's not my job to tell you who to keep company. Ooh, there's a poor girl. Why are you guys grouped in together? Are you hiding from the rain? You're it. Uh, she's the only one who's green. You're it. <laughs> You're it. <laughs> mm. oh, there's a poor boy uh, there too. Not vain. Because uh, from what I can gather, like green NPCs are. Somehow important. How come? I mean, his hair is also like milk. What do you mean? We have the same hair. Why am I the weird your one? Like milk. Okay, okay yeah, the NPCs are hiding from the rain. Oh, these guys aren't. They're just standing in the open. You know, you guys can enter inside, right? Come on. Get in there. Get in. Come on. You're getting wet she over here. Wet. Okay. You don't wanna. Where can I meditate? I don't think there's a meditation spot here, is there? There probably wouldn't be. Nope, it's not yet time for a rendezvous. Okay, yeah, I need a fire somewhere. My kingdom for a fire. Oh, all oh, this walking around just to see if Gero's gonna get laid. Jeez. <laughs> this is how I'm spending my time. <laughs> This is what I'm choosing to do with my evening. Can Geralt get laid? Alright, Reverend, I'm gonna meditate with you for a bit. Speak quickly. Mm, no, I'll can't. see you later. Hmm. Cannot meditate here. I guess I have to be inside somewhere to meditate. Although meditation was when I was speaking with him. Oh? Hmm. 
Well, this feels like a place I shouldn't be. Uh, see, I'm gonna get rid of some flint. And get this book. The screen is going fuzzy. I think it's reacting to something. The problem is to what? The pro prophecy of Ethelene. Egli ap av Avenian. I tell you that the time of the sword and axe approaches. The time of the wolf's blizzard. The time of the white frost and the white light. The time of madness and disdain. Ted derech. Ted derech. The final age, the world will perish amidst ice and be reborn with a new sun, reborn of the elder blood, of Hen Iker, of the planted seed. A seed that will not sprout but burst into flame, as Tuath Esse, so shall it be. Watch for the signs, I will tell you what these signs will be. The earth will run with the blood of An Sed. The blood of the elves. And said, and said, said, I'm really sure. Right, now, now I'm gonna drop it. Still not sure what's reacting, why the image is going fuzzy. I feel like this is a sign that there's something here I should take note of. Or maybe I'm just wasting my time. It's one or the other. It could be both. Alright, no place to meditate. Now, I feel like I walk past fireplaces all the damn time. And I never make use of them. Now that I need one, that I'm actively looking for one... I don't see any. Am I just blind? Someone over here trying their luck. Like, there are campfires over there. Definitely spent way too much time wandering around for literally no, no reason whatsoever. <laughs> yeah, there's a fireplace. It was... Yeah, no, I'm just... I, I walked past it. Midnight. Uh, so what time is dusk precisely? Talents as well, huh? Let's increase my strength. So let's become more powerful. Vitality regeneration. I feel like that's gonna be useful. I'm gonna get that. My parry plus 10. Harry might be good. Enables Gero to drop and place the power twice.
provides knowledge about selected not yet encountered monsters this might be good if, especially if it's going to give me like ingredients and components before i can even purchase the books yeah i gotta get that Give him the parry. Strong style increase the damage. The fast style as well. Yeah, I feel this is good. Let's rest. 